hope you're having a great day. I am off from work. Joined here today with my Hi. partner. How are you today? Hello, everyone. It's a very special day today. On my way to my son's place. He's turning 25. Bravo for him, right? Us two. Got another ton of gifts to give him. Gave him that skateboard I showed you guys. He's loving it. Hasn't busted his ass yet, but that gotta be coming. Anyway, mom baked the cake. She got it all. Red velvet. Wait till you see it. Incredible skill and decoration. It's a mini red velvet cake. You would, she should be a baker. I'm telling you, man. It's outrageous. And then, of course, he only got one present. That wouldn't be the skateboard. That would be the big bag that weighs about 50 pounds in the seat behind me. That's one <laughs> present. So. Hey, it's his 25th birthday. He deserves what he could get. We all deserve what he could get. Yeah. Well. Anywho, I'm gonna head on over there, checking on the sick dog. See how that goes. She had her operation yesterday, so she's in recuperation mode and a lot of whining, crying, and barking. From my son. I don't know what the dog is doing, but <laughs> well, anyway, he's a wary wart. That's all. Yeah, you know, he's in worse shape than the dog. So uh, we'll see what's going on over there. Do a little birthday celebration. I'm not a big red velvet cake guy, but I'm telling you, you gotta see this cake, my wife. So y'all saw that mess, huh? Out of control, half shaven dog. And the person that's having more of a fit, the owner. Unreal. He lacks alpha dog skills, my son. I'm working on that still. He didn't know how to yell at that dog and put it in its place. Otherwise, he wouldn't have half the problems he has. Anyway, seems very active for a dog that just had an operation. It's unreal. It was a good time. Cake was delicious. Headed home, of course. It's raining. Like, is there a day this week that I've shown you video where it hasn't rained yet? It's like, I don't even know if it's worth pointing out anymore because, you know, I guess I won't. It's hurricane season. It's going to be raining a lot. So we'll be dealing with it. Anyway, don't see a bike ride in tonight's future. And don't really feel like I have the energy to work on the bench or any of my projects. So I think I may wind up going home and curating the rest of the pictures. I'm not even sure about that. I think I decided the other day that I curated all the ones that I actually like. The rest from that shoot are history. They're packed away. Next, this weekend's shoot. Yeah, maybe I'll tell you about that. I think I told you a little hint, hint dropping yesterday, but I think I'll, I'll let you in on exactly what the location is. But for now, I probably should put both my hands back on the steering wheel. It's getting a little dicey. Oh, I think that's, that's never good. Oh, my goodness. Dark hair everywhere. She's a little shedder. I'll tell you what. She really sheds. She sheds a whole other dog per day almost, that little thing. Unbelievable. Ah, she'll be all right. Like I said, my son's the one that's uh, suffering more than the dog. That's a good place. It'll hold it there. Yep. It was his birthday, 25. We've had him around for a long time now. I guess he's all broken in. He's kind of an adult. He's used to living alone. He takes care of himself. Uh, and you still worry about them every single day and want to take care of them and solve all their problems and do everything they need to get done. It's a parent's job just never ends the level of worry just becomes a little bit less and a little bit less, but I don't think it ever really goes away. Next, we'll be speaking to my daughter. I haven't spoken to her in like a week or two, and I'm getting a little nervous. She's fine. Everything's great, but 
I like to hear her voice, make sure everything is really fine, you know. I can always tell when I speak with her, so definitely that's on the agenda. Talk to her this weekend. I know she's been talking to her brother today because it was his birthday, but I got to hear it myself. Anyway, tomorrow's only Thursday. Uh, kind of sad. I really want tomorrow to be Friday. I'm so over this week. I have no way to tell you how much I am done and want to be done for the week. The only upside is I believe my boss, well, I know my boss is off for the next two days. And like you've seen in the past, when she's off, it's, uh, it's a little bit pleasurable to be on the job. So I'm looking forward to that. You know, that puts a smile on my face, but still not as good as if it was Friday. But I'll, I'll make do with uh, what I get. Anyway, I think I'm going to call it an early night. Really didn't have much to do tonight. Not much to share with you guys. So we will just wrap it up here. And always, y'all know how we do it. Comment, like, subscribe. We're about one away from hitting that water. Could use the hold off day anyway. One more day. Means I'll probably be getting in there Sunday instead of Saturday, so it's up to you. I mean, you guys push and just find a friend to subscribe and it'll just come that much sooner, but and I'm getting my hands on my wetsuit still. I thought I had it all figured out and then I'm actually not the size of the one I found, which I'm glad I found out in advance, but uh, yeah, so mission will change on that, ordering a different wetsuit, so hopefully... Maybe I can find one locally and like a plate against sports or somewhere like that, but if not, I've ordered, well, I know the one I'm going to order, I already have it set up, I'm going to run inside now and go ahead and throw my bid in, it's on eBay, pretty much just win it, it's been sitting there, I think there's only a couple hours left, so I'll probably ninja that one, and like I said, comment, like, subscribe, love ya, see y'all tomorrow.